Hi, my name is Tuli and today I will talk you through our feature surveys. We'll have a look at how you can create them in the platform, how you can send them to candidates, as well as how we can look at the results. Let's have a look. To start using surveys in your Team Taylor platform, you will need to firstly navigate to your company menu, from there to add on features, and then simply scroll down on the page until you find the surveys. Then all you need to do is to simply click onto the surveys and the activate button down the bottom here. Now that your surveys is activated, you can either get to straight editing your surveys by clicking onto the configure button here, or you can also find your surveys up the top on your main menu. When you click to the survey section, you'll be able to create new surveys by clicking onto the pink plus button here on the right hand side. From there, you'll have the option of either using one of our templates or creating your own surveys from scratch. Once you've selected the way that you want to start building your surveys, you'll firstly be able to add a title for your survey, as well as then start building onto the questions. As you can see, we have a few different question types that you can use. And if you choose the single choice question option, you'll be able to make the following questions appear based on the answers that your candidates give you. Once you have added in all the questions that you want to ask your candidates, on the right hand side here, you'll be able to customize some survey settings. Firstly, you can choose if these answers should be anonymized or if you want them to be fully open responses. From there, you can also choose if you want the candidates to be able to skip your surveys, as well as if their answers should be displayed as part of their candidate card. Next, you'll also be able to customize the email that gets sent out with this survey, as well as a thank you page that will be displayed to the candidates after they have answered. Once you have saved your survey, you will find it here on your list with a summary of how it's performing at the moment. If you want to find some detailed information on this survey, you can of course always click onto it and find out what your candidates have been saying. These reports are also possible for you to pull out as a CSV file from the platform. We have a few different ways for you to send out your surveys to the candidates, and where I am now is inside a jobs editing view. If you want the surveys to appear as part of the application process, you can add a survey here. This survey will then pop up to the candidates at the time of them clicking apply to the job. The next place we can send out surveys in is in your stages section. In the stages, you can simply select the stage that this survey should be sent in, click to stage actions, triggers, and then from there, send survey. You'll then simply be able to select the survey that you're wanting to send out to the candidates. We can also send out surveys from the candidates tab. We can send them to multiple candidates by clicking onto the bulk select, selecting the candidates we're wanting to send this survey to, clicking onto the three dots, and then from there, send survey. If you want to send an individual candidate a survey, you can simply click onto their profile, the three dots down the bottom here, and you'll also be able to find send survey button here. Thank you for watching. Remember that if you need help in any point, you can always reach out to our support team via the chat in your platform. Happy recruiting!